Fuck, man. Hmm. Going second. Nice. It's unfortunate that I still saw Ash there after putting it to two. You know, not one of my not one of my six of uh, uh, starters. Smile. Oh, this ends. Once again, shit. And it's still the same 15 card. It's still the same 45 card ratio. The ratio has not changed to my of my trap tricks monsters. I refuse to change the ratio of my trap tricks monsters because it's the most consistent without drawing too many. I don't have an ash. So if he starts his turn, if he like gets a this is Exodia and he gets something like a Royal Magical Library on the board, I just lose. Yeah, I think this is Exodia. Okay. And there's the Royal Magical Library. He gets it right here. This doesn't mean anything unless I draw into Ash. He's gonna he's gonna discard the spell. There's no reason not to. You definitely discard a spell here. It's Royal Magical Library. What? It's Treasure Panda. You mentioned. I actually don't know what this is. I assumed this was Exodia, and now, now I don't know what to think anymore. <laughs> I, I'm not sure what the fuck this is. Oh, shit. I'm gonna banish the last card from the graveyard just so he doesn't have it. So he can't just keep pulling them out of the deck because now he gets to pull another limb. So he's gonna have two limbs already. I don't know what kind of weird Exodia deck this is, but it was Exodia. I was right. The very weird Exodia list. I wish I had an Ash for that Summoner Monk, dude. The game would have been over. Mm -hmm. Two limbs, I draw two cards. You have no more spells in your graveyard. Crooked Cook? You can destroy them and then add them back? Also, why is this not once per turn? What the fuck? Next. I don't know what the fuck this deck's supposed to do now. Goldred? Yes, Goldred. So you use Goldred. Thanks for the card, I guess. It, it's, it's not that important. He gets to draw what? Draw three, put one back, right? He's got to have a way to add those back. If I had not shotgunned that DD Crow, I would have been better off right now because I'd be I would have been able to banish one of the fucking pieces, one of the Exodia pieces. Oh, I messed up so bad. I think if he can't if he can't get it this turn, 
We called by the Exodia pieces. Yeah, he got it. He somehow got it. He's gonna keep going. He's gonna keep digging. This is so annoying. <laughs> this is that this is definitely super fucking annoying. Why do y'all play like this, man? Why do y'all do this to yourselves? I'm so confused. Holy shit. And here's the Real Magical Library. Does he have it? Or does he have a treasure panda? He has another treasure panda. If that last card's Exodia, he won, right? Let's see it. Unless I draw another DD Crow. Nope. I mean, I'm gonna draw my whole deck here. Isn't there? I just need to draw another. I need to draw another DD Crow. If I draw another DD Crow and I banish one of the Exodia pieces, he can't win. Yes! 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 Absolutely! fucking Luli! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Dude, they're all at one. You're dead. You literally lost the game, bro. Yes! You're the top deck of the century, baby! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Yo, fuck these Exodia players! Get that shit out of here, baby! <laughs> <laughs>